Welcome to Spiritual Dessert Truths episode 142 for Russell Brand and other people. Today's is about fluoride. I'm stuck on it because we're getting poisoned. <laughs> uh, I'm not. <laughs> I am drinking this water. So when I was talking about fluoride water before, not that I'm making an advertisement, but yes, go for a reputable spring water and save your life. It seems that the government, I'm reading a few things here, wants mind-altering toxin, fluoride, to be consumed. So, the chemical added to drinking water <clears throat> in Hitler's concentration camps to induce docility, which is like docile and passive, <laughs> is to be flushed through every municipal water pipe in England and Wales, according to a leaked government document. In some areas, the process already begun. Yeah, it's in the U.S., all over the place. They've been lying to us uh, through their teeth <laughs> since the 1940s when they kind of accidentally, maybe kind of more on purpose, dumped it in the water from some sort of a chemical incident in New Jersey. Nice. <laughs> we were been backwoods, so we got some well water. We thought we thought we weren't getting the good water. Duh! Instead, we were getting the good water. We were getting the water without the fluoride. Significantly higher grades. It's already begun. Britons are to be mass medicated with the fluoride water. They're calling it fluorination. A key ingredient in the making of atom bomb. And on a scale never witnessed before, nobody has any real concept of the potential psychological harm. We're in a war situation. A war on the mind, says Cynthia Bakchi, founder of campaign group. Got no, no. <laughs> says fluoride Biachi. I hope I said that right. Founder of campaign group Fluoride Free Bedford. Maybe it needs to be thrown in the light now because neither the scientific nor the legal routes have worked. It's the third leg of the stool. The idea that fluoride could be used as part of a wider dumbing down agenda. The post-war rebranding, I read, of fluoride from chemical weapon to harmless nutrient that protects against tooth decay is looking shakier than ever with a proliferation of studies showing fluoride lowers IQ and damages the hippocampus, part of the brain needed for memory and learning. Long-term ingestion of fluorinated water means you'll be able to function normally as the parts of the brain regulating repetitive behavior will not be affected, but new information will become harder to process, making you more receptive to propagandized news. <laughs> the same shit over and over. <laughs> Not funny. So most of Becky's peers on the anti-fluoride movement have tended to steer clear of the idea that hexofluorosilicic... Boy, I'll tell you. Try that again. <laughs> of the idea that hexofluorosilicic acid, the technical term for fluoride, look up that spelling, <laughs> could be part of an elite conspiracy <clears throat> for obvious reasons. It's always dangerous to speculate since so doing we run the risk of seeming to be less well-grounded than those sponsoring fluorination, warns Joy Warren, co-coordinator of the West Midlands Against Fluorination. Even truthers can relate to that. UK Collapse Radio's Alison Budin says we're trapped in debt and people are scared of losing their jobs. They're scared of raising their voices and losing what little security they have. Very few people will stand up for justice unless that's a direct threat to themselves. I don't know why I'm standing up. <laughs> I love you all, damn it. <laughs> yeah, and it's terrible. People are getting fooled. This is nasty. Not right. Fluoride has been known by British secret intelligence as a mind dulling agent since the Cold War, and they became aware of the KGB's experiments with the chemical. And earlier this year, scientists Felipe Grandjean and Philip Landergran showed fluoride is linked to neurodevelopmental disabilities, including autism, attention deficit disorder, hyperactivity disorder, dyslexia, and other cognitive impairments affecting millions of children worldwide. I think I'm doing it because I love the children. It's just wrong. Everybody thinks, yeah, it's in beautiful teeth. It's not about your teeth. I know. That's just wrong. I know it does, and he's drinking distilled water. <laughs> it's definitely not right. 
with the mainstream media controlled by vested interests, the issue is likely to remain hidden, relegated to the realm of conspiracy theory unless it can find a platform, suggests Bugin. Fluoride is not a major topic right now, but alternative media networks can bring in the scientists and raise its profile. You'll get a lot of people talking about it and on social media using hashtags, and that's the only way we're going to win by standing this together. By standing by this together. <laughs> Such an idea could just reinvigorate battle-weary campaigners and draw in a few disgruntled consumers reluctant to pay their water bills inclusive of rat poison. <clears throat> Another use for this acid. Some of us have realized the truth about fluoride just in time and are beginning to fight back and warn others. We've all been tricked. I can see the effect of fluoride on the next generation already. It's easier not to do anything. The thyroid is affected, and that makes you depressed. You have to work really hard on your spiritual side. But what's really worrying is that fluoride calcifies the pineal gland, the brain's link to the higher realm. That is why we have to encourage people to detox. It's now the responsibility of all of us to alert friends and family of the dangers and help bring perceptions of fluoride back to its original understanding as a neurotoxin and protect the mental well-being of future generations. I love you. It is one degree, actually it, it rose. It's now three degrees with a wind chill factor between minus one, now it's 15 and minus 25. And I've been asked to go Latin dancing. <laughs> I, I just, I can't tolerate the snow anymore. I can't tolerate this gold anymore. Oh man. Yeah, I don't know. See, for, for me, I think hell would not be fire. Hell would be ice. <laughs> anyway, look, I managed to stay warm enough. Woo, took a hot shower. I'm ready. <laughs> Love you. Mwah. Stay safe and drink this water, nothing, or some other one that's spring water that's not fluorinated. Because I, what is it? Because I want your brain to be able to think and connect with the higher realms. We are all the divine in a human costume. And um, yeah, I look forward to the day I shed it. But for now, I'm going to dance. <laughs>